Alright, so with Twitch going through the rounds of fucking people over, I feel that it is a good time to talk about why Twitch and video game streaming is so popular, and thankfully the reason is really simple. And that is that people really don't have the time or the money to play every video game that they are interested in. I myself fall into this category. Being a man with two jobs, a YouTube channel, a girlfriend, and a girlfriend on the side, I just don't have as much time as I used to just to sit down and play a game. But watching a game on the monitor in my kitchen while I'm cooking is totally different. That way I can view a game while doing odd things around the house, and that is extremely useful. Amazingly enough, Video game companies in the past didn't like the streaming or showcasing of playthroughs of their games on YouTube, but many people will often watch like the first 30 minutes of a playthrough and use that time to help them to decide whether they wish to buy the game or not. Now sure there are reviews out there, I myself even do shitty reviews, but a lot of people prefer the early parts of a playthrough to help them make their decision. Rockstar had a tiff about this as well in the past, but stated that they didn't mind an entire playthrough of their game Grand Theft Auto V, but what they didn't want to see was for people just to put up the cutscenes of the game, and to a large degree, the YouTube community has respected their decision. Now this is a good example of a developer meeting their fan base halfway and everyone benefiting from it, rather than the Nintendo or Sega shit, where in the past they just, if you posted up their content, they would just try to ban your channel or give you copyright strikes. History has taught us that nothing will ever stay the same and technology will progress whether you like it or not. Streaming is here to stay and the gaming industry, whether it knows it or not, is better off for it because giving people the chance to experience your game as a viewer can be a great experience, especially with more cinematic games like Uncharted or The Last of Us. We find ourselves in a time where games as an art form can be experienced on a vast amount of levels, so let's hope that the people won't ruin it before we get to see it blossom into something truly lovely.